So a lot of you guys know, I'm having a lot of difficulties with my Project Mix.io, trying to get a part, but long story short, Avid tells me I can replace the part, but they don't have it in stock. So I got tired of waiting and I picked this up. I went and I got myself the Mac Control Universe. Um, over here you see this uh, display. The Project Mix.io has the same display, except if I was working on the snare and it would clip, the indicator would just freeze. There was no way to clear it. I had to shut the board off, turn it back on. With this, if you clip, a little star will appear right there and you just clear it in Pro Tools and back to normal. Another thing that I like over here, you can use this for multiple uh, things. If you have a compressor, you could control your compressor with these uh, controls here, or your EQ, or uh, your pan. But there's a little uh, red LED here. So if I go left, the uh, LED moves left. If I go right, it moves right. Project IO did not have that. Another thing that I like here, over here you have another display. It'll show you the time of the bars. I think that's pretty cool. Another thing that's pretty handy, it connects through MIDI. There's no Firewire, no USB. There's no ins, no outs. No clock, no spit if, none of that. There's nothing, just MIDI. Some of you guys might not like that. I was reading online that uh, some people prefer these controllers to have, uh, you know, USB or Firewire. The Project I.O. in about a year, I'm pretty sure they're going to drop support. The next five years, whatever operating system is available, you're not going to have any drivers for it. So you can not use it. I'm pretty sure Pro Tools and other DAWs are going to support Huey. Uh, you have other control surfaces out there that use different protocols. They're higher in resolution, much better than this, but they're really expensive. I got this for a really good deal, and it works with everything I use. It works with Pro Tools, it works with Live, it works with uh, Reaper. Those are my uh, three programs right there. Now, another cool thing, this comes with overlays. As you can see, over here we have uh, the digital performer. So you put this right here. Now you have all the controls. So you take that out, I have another one, sonar, put that in, check it out, pretty cool, right? And these are the only two that it came with, but hey, you don't really need them, it just tells you the controls. I'm pretty sure they have one for Pro Tools, so there you go guys, I just wanted to keep you guys updated. If you like this video, right there on the screen, you're going to see a subscribe button, click that, give me a thumbs up, post on the bottom, hit me up on Twitter, hit me up on Google+, and I'm out of here. Later guys.